Hey, it is Michael Taggett here with the truth. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, everybody knows about Sandy Hook, that it, you know, what happened, and what, that it really happened, and that it was a disgusting act of violence and by a disturbed young man. And we've been trying to figure out why things like this happen. And then you get these conspiracy people who come on, and I know I could use harsher language, but you know what, I'm going to try to refrain myself from calling them every name of the book, okay? But, you know, you get these conspiracy people get on here and make these crazy outlandish claims like it was a cover-up. It was a conspiracy. The government's out to get our guns. But then when something like this happens, you just got to know that this, this something like this is disgusting. It's genuinely because everybody's like, well, how do we know it was fake? Maybe the, 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 the conspiracy nuts are, no, this is from the Daily Coast. New York City principal stages hoax school shooting on 300 special ed kids. Well, I bet you're like, well, maybe the kids knew. No, that would that if they'd have told the kids, hey, look, we're going to stage this. We want to see how everybody reacts and everything, and how good our response time is. That would have been fine, you know, because they've had tornado drills and stuff in schools and everything. You, you tell the kids and everything, you set it up. You're like, hey, we're going to do this and stuff. Let's see how good your response time is so that way if a tornado ever happened, you'd be okay. So if they would have came into the classroom and said, hey, hey, kid, look, we're going to do a school shooting drill and everything. You kids, we're going to see what happens. You know, they, they're, I don't know why. They don't really tell why this happened. You know, I wish the Daily Coast would have went into more detail. I've been trying to find. Um, according to a hernwatch.org, the anonymous watch cat group uh, for New York City Public School in 79, the Tuesday after the uh, Newtown Elementary School shooting, Principal Greer Phillips and her administration planned a, in secret, secretly to make do without the Department of Education's guidelines for drills and design their own. Problem? They decided on purpose not to tell any of the 300 kids aged 12 and up or any of the uh, over uh, 100 staff with teachers before they took to the school uh, wide intercom and shouted into the uh, most panicked voice they could, Shooter in the building! I don't know that, Michael, you're going to blame NRA nuts? No, because we don't know who staged this. You know, they could have just, they could have been paranoid about guns. You know, about like, oh my god, I don't like guns at all. Or they could have been a gun nut. You know, well, we don't know that. At least not yet. But what we do know is this was a despicable act, and she should be fired. Her and her whole administration, the people who went along with this lollygag of a despicable act, you need to be fired. And this is why I hate conspiracy theories. Everybody's like, why? Because when something like this happens, this is real. This is not a hoax. This woman and her crazy staff, I don't care what their political party is. I don't know what it is. I actually chose them. They're like, why are you not going to learn? No, because I want people to know this. Everybody thinks it's just the right wing and the NRA I jump onto. If this was a, a person, who, a paranoid person who is super paranoid about guns, an ultra-liberal person who hates guns, then they need to be held accountable for their actions. I don't give a damn who you are. So, anyway... That happened, and it's this. Please fire her. Fire her in the administration. Just downright disgusting. I, I'm at a loss for words.